the greatest songs, the greatest protest songs, greatest art has always come out in times like this. It's artists who are the ones that interpret it. Wake up! Do the right thing opened June 30th, 1989, and as relevant as if it came out yesterday. I think that's a testament to the truth that have been in my films. And just that cry, wake up, is still relevant. Wake up! Last line, in school days, wake up. Please, wake up. And the first two words, do the right thing. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Up you wake, up you wake, up you wake, up you wake. So I think that very film since then, somehow I've had somebody say, wake up. Wake up, wake up. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Wake up, white man. Sorry, who am I talking to? But not always to the camera, but to <laughs> somebody else. I love history. A lot of stuff people weren't taught in this country. You know, I grew up learning about the story about George Washington cutting down the cherry tree and he couldn't tell a lie. I was never taught that he owned 123 slaves. I was never taught that Christopher Attucks was the first person to die for the United States of America. And there's so many things that have not been taught. Today, and it's 1983, the murder of Wade Raheem by the NYPD was based upon the murder of the graffiti artist named Michael Stewart by New York City transit cops. They killed Radio Raheem's murder. They did it again, just like Michael Stewart. So 83, Michael Stewart, and the fictional character Ray Raheem, 89, then you got Eric Gardner and King Floyd. But how much progress has it been? We see what is happening recently, far too recently far too often the murder of black bodies, black souls. I'm seeing it today. I saw it in Santa Monica, LA. I see it in Des Moines, Iowa, Salt Lake City. That my fellow Americans, and particularly the, the, the younger generation, are out there in the streets, joining hands with their black and brown brothers and sisters, or sometimes alone when there's no black and brown people around them. So that's very heartwarming for me. Something that I haven't seen since I was a young kid. The greatest songs, the greatest protest songs, the greatest art has always come out at times like this. You know, they, you do your thing when, when, when shit's up. <laughs>